Hello everybody! I am missing you all very, very much. I miss seeing you skipping into school in the morning. I miss hearing you laugh. I miss um, seeing your lovely, curious faces and answering your questions. I just miss teaching you. Um, if we were in school at the moment, year two would be learning all about the rainforest, which is one of my favourite topics. And I'm really sad that we're not all there together, investigating and becoming explorers. Um, but I hope you've been enjoying some um, of the home learning or using this time to learn a new skill. I've absolutely loved talking to some of your parents and especially talking to some of you, the brave ones who got on the phone and hearing about all the things um, that you've been up to. Very big well done to those of you that have learned to ride your bike in lockdown or who have learned to bake something new in the kitchen or have made something creative. Um, and beautiful, learnt a new skill. I'm so proud of you and so impressed. Um, and well done for everyone who's doing lots of reading and getting out and doing your daily exercise as well. Um, I think that most of you have heard my news, but if not, um, my exciting news is that I'm actually having a baby. So it's an exciting time for me as I prepare for her arrival, hopefully in the end of June, which is really exciting. But other things I've been doing in lockdown, I have learnt to make lots of fun things in the kitchen. I've learnt to make bread, which is really fun. And I have been loving getting into gardening. So I thought I would show you a couple of special things in my garden. Come and have a look. Over here we have um, some raspberries. These are my raspberries and each one of these flowers, and you can see there's loads, are going to turn into raspberries, which are going to be ready to pick, hopefully, at the time around the baby comes, which is really exciting and scary. Down here, have a look. I think you should all know what these are. These are going to be strawberries, and I love strawberries. And come over here, these are exciting because I planted these from little packets of seeds. Have a look, this is all of, this is some lovely veg. This is um, lettuce over here. We've got some kale, and that one's beetroot and onions. Over here, we've got carrots and courgettes. And have a look down here at this lovely red colour. That's going to be a radish. I wonder, have any of you planted any seeds during this time in lockdown? If you hadn't, haven't, I'd really encourage you to, because it is so fun to watch a seed germinate and then investigate what it needs to stay nice and healthy, including, I'm gonna put this cage down, including keeping the birds and the squirrels away because they love digging up my veg patch a little snippet of what I've been up to in lockdown. I am so proud of all of you for all that you're doing and just want to encourage you to keep going. You are amazing and I really hope that I will see you all very soon. Okay, bye-bye. Hello to RK. I hope everybody's well and keeping safe. I have really missed you and your smiley faces and I can't wait for us all to get back together again. So take care and until then, I hope you're being good at home and making sure you're doing lots of kind things to help out and look after each other. Hopefully I'll see you soon. Bye. Hi everyone, it's just a quick message from me. It might look like I'm wearing a hat, but it's just Binks who's a bit camera shy and he's hiding behind me. But anyway, this is just a quick message to say that I hope you're all well and you're all staying safe. Um, it seems like such a long time ago since we were all together at school, um, but it's been lovely to see so many photos and videos being sent in of all the amazing work you've been doing. If you haven't been able to send any in, then don't worry, because when we go back to school, if you bring your work in, we'll have a huge celebration of all the amazing things you've achieved while you've been at home. There was one last thing that I did want to say, and that's just a reminder that when we are at home, just to be as kind as you would be when you're in school, remember to try and do something every day that would put a smile on someone's face. That can be something big or it can be something small. So that's your challenge. Can you make somebody in your household smile every single day? Mm -hmm. Other than that, I hope you take care and hopefully I'll see you soon. Bye. Hello everyone. Mrs. Fisher here with Ruby. Just wanted to say hello and hope that you are all keeping very safe and well. I've spoken to lots of your mummies and daddies 
which has been lovely and also I've spoken to some of you which is even more special and I have seen some of you in the park which is fantastic haven't we Ruby? So Ruby's enjoying having me at home she's had lots of lovely walks out in the park but I am missing you too so I hope it won't be long before we all see each other but in the meantime I'm so impressed with all the lovely work that you've been doing I've seen lots of uh, pictures and videos of the exciting things you've been doing at home, so well done. So my main message at the moment is keep safe, keep happy and have lots and lots of fun with your mummies and daddies and brothers and sisters. Be kind to your mummies and daddies and be kind to your brothers and sisters as well. Um, but keep well and safe and hope to see you very, very soon.